Hey guys, welcome. Welcome guys to another edition of uh, q and I'm your host, Crispy Card. Crispy Crazy Card. How you guys doing today? Hope you guys are doing good. Hope you guys can hear my mic very well today. Um, today is Q&A day. Um, I'm doing a really quick uh, Q&A. I'm sorry about the quality of the video. I'm just trying to test it to see if I can do this onto the... On the tablet. Sorry. Anyway, guys, um, we've got some questions here, so I'm going to answer them right now. Um, hopefully, you guys are doing good. Hopefully, you guys are doing excellent today. Okay, so let's, uh, let's get on with the questions, shall we? Okay, question, the first question comes from Salawar15. Okay, and he asks, what new idea or team event would you like to see in Season 3 on WWE Supercard? Well... I thought of a really good idea actually um, just the other day. Um, you, if if anybody's familiar, they know if you guys know what Blackjack 21 is. Uh, Blackjack 21 is a card game that you guys can play. It's really cool. Um, it like kind of like they should incorporate like card games into the event, kind of like a Blackjack 21. And um, you know you got your what is it? Your event card as your like king, a your king and queen, and then you have your other cards uh, lower, almost like similar to the cards uh, on the deck of of a card deck, but um, uh, but just uh, based on that, do you could uh, just rate your cards with that, and then it, you play like a blackjack twenty one type of event. I thought of that event as well as thinking of. Uh, there was another event I thought of too, uh, with Texas Hold'em Poker. I don't know if you guys are familiar with that as well. Um, the highest card, of course, will be your event card, and the lowest card will be obviously the the scrappy one, the scrappy cards, uncommon, common, things like that. So that, that that's something I thought of. Uh, I thought it was really cool that they could do something like that. Um, I've also thought about they should do instead of doing a event card for one tier do it for all the tiers I'll do it up to uh, from ultra rare ultra rare all the way up to survivor obviously okay so each each person gets a chance to win that event card for that tier let's say uh, let's say you're in like ultra rare you want to get to epic the best way you could do that is getting that ultra rare card and each card is gonna have special abilities on on the on the event card Ultra Rare, um, Epic, Legendary, Ultra Rare, Epic, Legendary, and uh, Survivor. You could do it on those. Um, also on Rare and Super Rare. Get rid of the Commons and Uncommons. We don't because we don't use those cards that often. So from Rare all the way up to Survivor, have tiers, uh, have event cards for each and every one of those uh, tiers. So that way. You know, you don't have to worry about getting to the survivor card or, oh my God, I'm up to the survivor card. I can't believe this. There you go. You have your 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 event card for each tier, which is really cool. I thought it was a really good idea. Um, those are kind of the things I've been thinking of, and kind of like I was also thinking of like an elimination chamber type of uh, event too, where uh, you you go against like four or five other cards, and you have to. I don't know. You have to. You, you have to beat those cards in order to uh, win the event. Uh, that's kind of a... I don't know. I've been thinking of a lot of different events uh, that they should have. But they definitely need a new event in this uh, in this game. Okay, the next question comes from Leighton Peters. He's one of my uh, teammates on Crispy Maniacs. How's it going, Leighton? Do you think they should add another tier after WrestleMania? And what should it be called? Hmm. You know, I really don't think they're gonna. I don't. I really don't think they're gonna do that because I don't think it makes it. I don't think it. I don't think it serves a purpose to them to do another tier. It'd be nice um, to do a WrestleMania one or maybe like a Hall of Fame one or an Elite. You have Elite ones um, like a foil card, almost like NBA, and you have those like, and those will be like special cards for that tier like any elite you know elite the let you know uh hall of fame or elite i think it'll be called that if it was a tier but i don't think they're going to do that anytime soon most likely they'll be doing a season three card excuse me a second guys Ugh. 
Okay, and the last question. Gaming with Vince. My favorite, the favorite WWE pay-per-view outside of WrestleMania. Oh, for me, would be, let's see, WrestleMania. Oh, no, I'm sorry, not WrestleMania because he said not WrestleMania. Oh, I miss the Elimination Chamber. They should bring that back. Personally, that's my opinion. They should definitely bring back the Elimination Chamber. I think that's awesome. I think it's really cool. They should do that. Um, that one and Extreme Rules. I like that pay-per-view. That's my favorite pay-per-view. Also, the Royal Rumble is my favorite pay-per-view. I have a lot of different ones. Um, and TLC is my favorite pay-per-view. Like I have like four different pay-per-views that are like my absolute favorite. So um, that is that, guys. Um, those are questions. Thank you, guys, for. Oh, and I forgot. Um, I did. I did have a Q and A uh, video up uh, with the WWE Supercard, but what happened with that was I took it down because of personal reasons. So um, I did get the questions though from from that uh, episode before I deleted it, and uh, I'm answering them right now. So thank you guys, Solid War 15, Leighton Peters, and Gaming Events. Thank you guys so much for answering the que for. Uh, asking the questions um, and that are that is all the questions for the uh, for the Q&A thank you guys very much don't forget to uh, like click subscribe don't forget to participate in uh, another Q&A uh, feel free to ask questions uh, comments uh, feedback if you have any feedback that would be awesome definitely let me know uh, that something I can do better if there's something you want to see on the channel definitely let me know about that too uh, Q&A I definitely want to do this more and uh, be more interactive with you guys. So, Q&A. You know, definitely uh, feed me those questions, guys. And I'll definitely uh, I'll answer them next Friday or whatever you like. Yeah, I'll answer them. I'll get those, I'll gather them up and I'll answer them next week or the week after, if need be. Um, other than that, guys, uh, if there's any suggestions or anything like that you need me to do for the channel, let me know. Um, as far as gaming goes, what guys, what do you want to see? What do you want me to improve on? What do you need me to work on? What do you, what do you guys think? What do you guys want to see more of? Um, really would appreciate your feedback and suggestions. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. And uh, don't forget to like, click, subscribe, do all that good stuff, guys. Uh, show some support. And I'll definitely see you in the next one. Take it easy.